So running an SEO correlation test with, SERP, with your SERPs application is super easy. I'm going to show you the, the two steps that you need to do uh, to create a, a quick SEO correlation test that you can use to kind of prove uh, which changes you're making are working or which SEO tactics are, are working for you. So um, the first thing you need to do is to create a tactic. Now, uh, a tactic is just something you want to change um, and you want to track that change um, in SEO metrics since the time that you set up the test. So a tactic could be changing a title tag, it could be starting a uh, link campaign, it could be a specific link you get from, um, you know, press outreach. Basically, anything you want to change, uh, you want to track, um, you want to create as as a tactic first. So, um, so we'll just say um, we'll name the tactic change title, change title tag, and we'll put in the category uh, on page and doesn't really have cost and hit create tactic. Cool. So now we've created this new tactic called change title tag, uh, put it in the category here. And any any tactics you create will be shared across your account. Um, so if you create one for one site for SERPs here, um, the other sites will be able to use that tactic as well. So now that we have our tactic, we want to, we want to apply it to a specific page and a specific uh, keyword. Uh, so to do that, uh, we'll navigate to the page that we want to test. So let's say we change the serps.com title tag and we wanted to track how things uh, performed since that time. Um, to do that, uh, all you have to do is click on the date that you want to start the test. And that'll pop up this dialog here and you can choose the category. So let's say on page and we change the title tag and then we can assign it to a keyword. Um, so let's say we wanted to track SEO dashboard um, since this time frame and click create test. And if we reload re the page, you'll see uh, the triangle up here indicates a new uh, event or test uh, that, we, uh, that we started. Um, now that we have that set up, go back to the test page and you can see that we show the performance uh, since you started uh, after one week, after four weeks, and after eight weeks. And we assigned it to the specific keyword, and we track uh, the keyword organics, which is the amount of uh, keyword level traffic from Google, and the change in that since when we started uh, the change in Google rank, and then also the uh, change in page level organic traffic. Um, so this is really useful to see, you know, if if there's a change in metrics in the short term versus long term. And the nice thing is that SERPs will keep this updated for you, um, so you don't have to build a giant spreadsheet to to track this this type of uh, correlation test because um, that's just no fun. So that's how you set up a quick SEO correlation test uh, with SERPs.com, and uh, we'll be adding some more features and uh, functionality to this to be able to run a test at a site-wide level um, here in the next couple months. Thanks a lot.